Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. They had a small earthquake there in the Netherlands, a magnitude 2.8, only three kilometers in depth. But what makes this earthquake important is that they know that more than likely this earthquake was created, caused by the extraction of gas from the local, um, from the location. This area has a lot of gas extraction. In 2018, the government there of Nether the Netherlands did a study about the earthquakes that were occurring. And it was a very in-depth study there in the area of Groningen. Their conclusion was that, in fact, that the majority of these earthquakes were caused by the withdrawal of the gas from the ground. When gas extraction was reduced, the earthquakes were less in number. Yes, the Netherlands does have tectonic earthquakes, but those are in the southeast area of the country. Induced earthquakes have been recorded, and they know it's happening in the northeast of the country. Natural earthquakes that occur in the southeast of the Netherlands are caused by active rifts of the European Cenozoic Rift Systems. The 1992, it says here, um, Rotermound earthquake in the southeast province of the country was the heaviest registered earthquake in the Netherlands. It had a magnitude of a 5.8. Now, the induced earthquakes, since 1986, there's been around 1,000 induced earthquakes in the northeast of the Netherlands caused by the exploration of the growing gas field. They've been lucky. The largest earthquake in this area has been a magnitude 3.6. But it's just a matter of time before they have a large damaging earthquake. Um, you know, if history does repeat itself, like what we see going on around the world, there could be a magnitude 5.5 uh, or even larger, maybe a 7.5 earthquake or larger. And because the government does know that the extraction of the gas from the ground is causing the majority of these earthquakes, would they be held responsible for damages or injuries done to these poor people? You know, it's bad enough that we have nature throwing things at us. Um, here we got the pandemic of the coronavirus. We got um, plagues of different types of insects adverse weather, flooding, etc. And to think that people are also causing uh, disasters that are not whatsoever natural. What are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Please stay safe and I will talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.